Raiden is a vertically scrolling shooter video game originally developed by Saibu Kaihatsu and distributed by Tecmo in Japan on September 1990. It was the first game in the Raiden series of vertical scrolling shooter arcade games. The arcade version was also distributed in North America by Fabtech, Taiwan by Liang Hua Electronics, South Korea by IBL Corporation, Hong Kong by Hua Yan Electronics, and in a few other countries such as Malaysia, though the publishers in those countries are unknown. Raiden takes place in the year 2090 where the Earth has suddenly become the target of an deranged alien empire race known as the Kranosians and after the invasion, the World Alliance military builds a new cutting-edge weapon based on a captured alien craft, the Raiden supersonic attack fighter, as the only hope for humanity to survive. The game is inspired by other games in the genre such as Capcom's 1942 and Toplin's Twin Cobra. In addition to the original arcade version, several ports were released to multiple consoles and computers such as Sega Genesis, TurboGrafx-16, Super NES, FM Towns, PC Engine Super CD-ROM Squared, Atari Jaguar, MS-DOS, PlayStation, Atari Lynx, among others. Ports for both the Amiga and the Atari Falcon were in development by Imagitech Design but ultimately never released. Raiden was successful in the arcades, despite doubts by the staff at Saibu Kaihatsu, managing to sell 17,000 units worldwide and it was well received by players and critics alike. Console and computer ports of the game received generally positive reviews as well, and due to the success of the original, multiple sequels and related games were developed. Gameplay Raiden is a vertical scrolling shoot em up game consisting of eight stages where the player maneuvers the Raiden fighter craft dodging enemy bullets and destroying enemy robots, buildings, ground targets, and enemy aircraft. There are bombs and missile power-ups as well as collectible medals that players can collect, which increases the score at the end of each stage. When the player dies, the fighter's fragments become projectiles that damage enemies. On occasion an enemy carrier aircraft comes down and destroying it reveals two types of weapon power-ups, the Vulcan and the laser, which they can be powered up multiple times, while other times it reveals bombs and missile power-ups, which can be increased multiple times as well and on rare instances an P-icon appears, which instantly power-ups the ship to the max. There's also two types of missile, napalm and homing missiles. Shooting on the right spot of the playfield will reveal either of the two hidden bonus items, Mikeless, who was a boss in Saibu Kaihatsu's 1985 title Wiz, which grants 10,000 points and a fairy that grants 30,000 points if either two bonuses are picked up. After defeating the Stage 8 boss, the mission is completed, and player receives 1 million points for each completed loop. Afterwards, it will start back to Stage 1. This time around, enemies shoot faster and at a more rapid rate. Each stage increases in difficulty the more players progress into the game. In multiplayer, players can also generate a stream of shots by shooting in front of another Raiden ship to deal damage to enemies as well. If all lives are lost during a gameplay session, the player will start at the last checkpoint reached. Plot <inaudible> 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 In the year 2090, Earth has suddenly become the target of deranged aliens known as the Kranosians. Following the invasion, the World Alliance military builds a new cutting-edge weapon, the Raiden supersonic attack fighter. Based on a captured alien craft, it is humanity's only hope for survival. <laughs> Ports and related releases Raiden was ported to the FM Towns, PC Engine, Atari Jaguar, Atari Lynx, Super NES, Sega Genesis, Amiga unreleased, MS-DOS, and the mobile phone. The MS-DOS port was coded by Nigel Freddy Conroy, Steve Cullen and Martin Randall, and was spearheaded by Martin Hooley. There also exists a port of game for the Atari Falcon, made by Imagitech Design. The SNES, Genesis, and FM Towns ports were given the name Raiden Trad, or Raiden Densetsu in Japan. The reason for this is unclear, like all other ports of this game, they were not made or published by any of the same groups, and are wildly different from each other. 
The Lynx port was released by Telegames in 1997, long after the Lynx's commercial lifespan had ended, and was only available through direct order and a few select retailers. PlayStation See main article, the Raiden Project The project version of the first Raiden is available as a download from the Japanese PlayStation Network Store, which can be played on either a PlayStation 3 or a PlayStation Portable. Soundtrack A Raiden, Raiden 2 soundtrack was published by INHCO, Ltd. It includes soundtracks from Raiden Arcade, PlayStation, Raiden 2 Arcade, PlayStation, Raiden DX Arcade, and Raiden Densetsu FM Towns, as well as a booklet, Go Sato Liner Note, Gallery. Reception Electronic Gaming Monthly gave the Atari Jaguar version an average of 6 out of 10. The four reviewers agreed that it was virtually identical to the arcade version, but were divided about the quality of the game itself. Two of them described Raiden as, "...above average", and two described it as mediocre, saying that the ship moves too slow, enemy fire often blends in with the background, and the graphics are sub-par given the Jaguar's capabilities. GamePro similarly criticized that the gameplay is outdated, the ship moves too slow, and that the graphics do not live up to the Jaguar's potential. They concluded that a snoozer like Raiden just seems out of place on a powerful system like the Jaguar. <inaudible> Legacy Due to the success of Raiden, several sequels and related games were made. <inaudible> Notes <inaudible>